Does this actually look any decent? <gasps> it works. Oh, shoot. I'm echoing. All right. All right. <laughs> Happy Thursday. Let's go. I wasn't supposed to stream today, but I, I have to like experiment with some cocktails. So let me prep. I got to throw on some music. This is super chill. This is going to be a very different, different kind of stream. But yeah, um, let me let me pull up a chair actually. Uh, the chair. Welcome, friends, to. Uh, wait, does it actually have the full view? This is my what should we call it? Cocktail and chill stream. Um, so what this is really to do is, my friend has a birthday party celebration tomorrow. And we're supposed to bring some sort of cocktail. And I have waited to the very last minute to start working on a cocktail. So I have a recipe and we're going to try to dial it in perfectly so that I, I can show up with a banger cocktail. So my idea tonight is I'm going to make a milk tea with boba cocktail. So it's essentially milk tea with, with vodka. So we're going to try it. Um, I feel like it's going to take a couple attempts to get right, but I have all the ingredients. I've got the, the big boba straws today. We've got big boba straws. I've got some some vodka. I don't know anything about alcohol, so um, I hope this is good. I don't know if this is actually... It's called Tito's. I know nothing about it. Oh my god, can you guys see my dangling earring? That's actually really funny. Imagine preparing anything before it. I, I want to show up and I want to like knock people's socks off. I want to have a banger cocktail. So like I went out and spent like 40 bucks on alcoholic ingredients just for today. Barely, but I can see your mic. Oh yeah, mic's here. Uh, I can't put it here where I usually would because my necklace is magnetic and this is attached with a magnet and it just like keeps, it keeps like sticking and it's really annoying. Oh, it's, it, oh God, it's literally sticking right now. You see that? It, it's, it's, oh, the, the magnet's so annoying. That's okay. I moved it off to the side though. <laughs> Yeah, so we got, we got, this is where the alcohol is going to come from. Um, I've got a bunch of great value condensed milk. So this is for the milk syrup, the milk tea syrup. We've got half and half in the fridge. And then, uh, oh shoot, is this expired? Oh no, it's not. Um, and then we've got some Chinese tea that I picked up from the grocery store. I don't know. I just bought the most expensive black tea I could find. I don't even know if... More expensive tea means better tea. And then we've got... They didn't have black tapioca. Oh shoot, they didn't have black ta tapioca, so I got these golden tapioca pearls that we'll try. But essentially, this is... I think it's gonna be a really short stream. But uh, I wanted to run through this process, see how it tastes, and hopefully I don't get too drunk. Uh, my main concern is that there's a lot of milk in here, so I will actually have to run off at some point and get some lactate so I don't kill myself. But that's where we're at. Let me see. There's a... I'm kind of surprised that ping cord actually pings for the vertical streams too. Because I don't really schedule these. Yeah, but the milk is going to wreak havoc on my stomach. Uh, unless I'm prepared for it. So the thing is, I have Asian flush and I'm lactose intolerant. So I have to take lactate and I also have to take Pepsid to counteract the Asian flush. So I'm literally... Ha I have to medicate to drink my own beverage. Which is... Honestly, it's kind of ridiculous how much work goes into to medicating just to not die. But yeah, that's the plan for today. We'll put this off to the side. Pincord doesn't seem to care if it's scheduled or not. Oh, I, I just assumed that it only worked with scheduled, scheduled content. All right. So I think the first thing is first is we actually have to make the tea. I feel like that's an essential part. So here's the thing. I couldn't find any like boba recipes or uh, no, alcoholic boba recipes. Um, on the interwebs. So we're kind of just gonna have to wing it. So what today's stream is mostly gonna be about is trying to figure out like, what's it called? The, the ratios. Also, those pings are gonna get annoying. So I'm gonna disconnect from my thing. I don't know if you guys can hear my messenger pings, but I'm getting tons of messages for like no reason. How do I disconnect from any desk? Found it. Got it. All right, we're good. You guys won't get Facebook pings. Hey, Slohan, how's it going? <laughs> Happy Thursday. 
Thursday night. I'm, it's way later than usual. Unplay, unscan, unscheduled stream, but we're just chilling. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and what, what did I say I was gonna? I gotta grab lactate. I've gotta grab. Should I get a? I should get a stove, right? What else do I need? Yeah, so we, we have the black tea. I think we'll make this first. So the recipe is gonna be AI generated. <laughs> so I hope it tastes good. Otherwise I'm blaming AI. Just started? Yeah, we just started. How are you doing today? Hopefully you're doing well. Yeah, this is a much chiller stream, much chiller stream. There's no structure. So I imagine it's gonna be pretty short. Once I, once I nail in the ratios of this cocktail, we're just gonna call it a day. And I have music playing because I don't care about copyright this stream. I don't know if you guys can hear that. And go fucking crazy. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I keep on hoping we'll eat cake by the ocean. Yeah, I can make food recipes. Yeah. So I, I asked AI, I was like, hey, my friend is throwing a cocktail party, but I would like to have like a boba inspired cocktail. So it gave me a rough outline of the ingredients, and we're just going to have to play with the ratios, see how, how, we can, how good we can make it, right? So we're going to go ahead and let me get the lactate. I, I feel like I should take shots of shoju too. I'm just gonna get a Coke and I'll be right back. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. I see you driving around town with the girl I love and I'm like, fuck you. Oh, that's the queen version. Wasn't enough, I'm like, forget you. I'd still be with you. Yeah, ain't that some shit? Ain't that some shit? Pain in my chest. I still wish you the best with the forget you. Sorry, I can't afford a Ferrari. That don't mean I can't get you there. And I'm more than sorry. All right, now I'm souped up, ready to go. Let's get the burner. I got you know, ooh, ooh. Uh huh. I see you driving around town with the girl I love, and I'm like, forget you. It wasn't enough. I'm like, forget you and forget her too. Said if I was richer, I'd still be with you. Ain't that some shit? Ain't that some sh pain in my chest? I still wish you the best with the forget you. All right, so we need to start first with making a milk tea syrup, which looks like it requires, what is this? Two cups of water, four bags of black tea, and 200 grams of sweetened condensed milk. That's a lot of condensed milk. That's gonna mess me up. Bringing water to a boil, remove from heat, add tea bags. Oh, I just gotta boil water? I, we don't even need the stove then, right? Uh, add tea bags, steep for five minutes. Wait, this is gonna be so easy. We're gonna be done in like 10 minutes maybe. So we don't even need this. Let me get the, what's it called? The electric kettle. Forget you and forget her too. Said if I was richer, I'd still be with you. Ain't that some sh Ain't that some sh Pain in my chest, I still wish you the best with the forget you. I didn't measure the water at all. Baby, why you wanna hurt me so bad? Alright. One cup of water. Your dad, your dad, your dad. Why? Why? Alright, got it. Baby. Oh, I see you driving around town with the girl. I Wait, why'd they change the pitch? Alright, let me get the. We'll get a bowl. I think we can get a bowl so we can see the action happening. All right, ain't that some sh Ain't that some sh 
pain in my chest. I still wish you the best with the forget you. All right. So I don't know. This was the most expensive tea they had at the store. I don't know if that's going to make it taste any better. <clears throat> the first time I heard that song was in Breaking Stupid Laws, the UK video. Oh, wait, I can't see with the little heart. Is there a way to disable the little heart react? I don't know why that's there. Oh, I see it. Stupid Laws in UK video. Oh. Singing profane songs in public was a law being broken. Wait, really? Wait, you can't... You can't say profanities? Profanities out in the publics? Wait, could, do you actually get like arrested for that stuff? I can hear the chit chat. Take me to your love shack. How do I open this thing? Everybody talks, babe. Oh, got it. So we need four of these, it looks like. Hey, mercenary, how's it going? Just making some cocktails today. We're gonna be uh, attempting to make a boba cocktail. Wait, I do need boiling water. I need, I need boiling water for the tapioca. Uh, we'll, we'll do it one step at a time so it's not overwhelming. I don't think police care enough, unless you're actually being a disturbance. That's also fair. I, they probably have better things to do, right? Live to see the day. Everybody's words got in the way. Hey! Uh. Hey. Wait, how do I tell if my, my stream is being taken down? <laughs> is there like a... There's gotta be like a, a dashboard, right? Let's see. News is friction. It started with a whisper, and that was when he kissed her, and then she made my lips hurt. You're not dual streaming? I'm not, no, I'm not dual streaming a vertical stream. <laughs> if it's purely vertical, I don't think there's a, really a point to dual stream, right? I feel like usually copyright is much more lenient on Twitch. Not that it's supposed to be, but that's just how it is. I can't open this bag. Yeah, I get the scissors. And that was when I kissed her. I guess because it's so tough to open, that's probably why it's so expensive. They invested in anti-opening technology. Oh, I messed it up. I ripped right into the tea bag. Oh, this is horrible. Oh yeah, this, okay, I messed that one up. Uh, I'm gonna throw this out. <laughs> yeah. I also don't know how to simulcast a vertical stream. Like that's something I haven't figured out yet. I just haven't spent time looking into it, honestly. Dream it up, you'll be that girl, you'll be that girl, you'll be every- I don't even know the lyrics to this. In the atmosphere. We need four of these? Uh, uh. Na 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 na. 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 Closer to me, girl, and you'll understand. I hope I don't burn myself making this cocktail. Is it even really a cocktail if there's like not that much alcohol? I'm worried because the the recipe literally says like half vodka, half tea. I'm like I feel like it's gonna be a little strong, so we really have to be careful about tweaking. Tweaking the ratios. Such a 2010 song. I I don't know if you guys know, but my music taste is literally just 2010's music. I 
I live for 2010's pop club music. I feel like it's the best era of music. Cocktails are supposed to taste good and not make you drunk. Yeah. So I, I'm gonna try to make it so that we get just enough alcohol to hit that threshold where you can't you can't taste it. Like once it goes over that threshold, we want to find exactly the the spot where you can start tasting the vodka. Na 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 na. Na 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 na. Let me get the water. Na 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 na. Na. Oh, this song is such a banger. They make me feel. Na 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 na. You make me feel. Like na 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 na. Na 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 na. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. My hands are up. You just can't see it. Make my world stop. All right, where we go? Ahem. <clears throat> All right, hot water and tea. We're supposed to steep for like five minutes. Oh, it smells really strong. <sighs> na 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 na. My music taste is timeless. Trance, chip music, and metal. I've actually never really been that big into metal, but apparently the community for metal is like really welcoming. I just like, it hasn't really been for me. I had like a pop punk phase for a while though. I'm actually going to see a pop punk band in concert uh, next week and I'm really excited. Uh, look who's in a good mood. I'm just vibing today. Like there's no pressure for me to stream. So I'm just like, you know, when he cook, wait, it is? I just listen to whatever I like, never look for music communities. Wait, really? I really like music communities because I, I also like EDM a lot. And like, there are a bunch of EDM festivals and there's a really large community, I guess like, based around electronic music. It's actually really interesting. If you've never been to a rave, I would say give it a shot. Like I really like going to Porter Robinson concerts. Zed is a really nice concert. I went to Martin Garrix. Martin Garrix is really, really fun. I love Martin Garrix. I've been to Chip Music's concerts and stuff, but that's about it. I know like, didn't isn't Otto touring in the States? And then there's a Yasobi concert? I feel like those would be really fun too, but getting tickets are impossible. You also have the Miku concert. Let me get my, uh, should I get a spoon? I'll get a spoon. To the world, to the world, to the world. Take your time and you stand in line. So do I actually teabag here? We're gonna teabag. Look at that. Uh. <laughs> IRL teabag. I, I bring the fire, make you come alive. I can take you higher. They're really underground, but fun. I don't think I've really listened to chip music before. I tried to get the Miku, but it wasn't happening. Yeah, I hear they sold out like almost instantly. I think I'm introverted enough to not know music communities exist. I mean, even on the internet, music communities exist. Like there's always a handful, of, like there's always going to be people that enjoy the same music that you do. And it's just a matter of like finding those people. Like for me, when I meet someone new, I usually connect over music first. Cause it's, I think music is pretty universal. Because like, if you like K-pop, people who like K-pop are really into K-pop. If you like electronic music, people are really into that. Maybe I just listen to a lot of mainstream stuff and like throwback songs like these. I really love throwback music. It's, it's so fun. I've been to a couple of chip music concerts by the Vancouver Chip, chip Music Society and Square Sounds in Tokyo. Wait, what is, what is a chip music artist? Like who are, do you have like an example of like a, one that I might know? Now I don't remind you, let it rock, let it rock, let it rock. All right, let me check the recipe. So it says, we got that, we need 200 grams of condensed milk, bring the water to a boil, 
add bags, remove tea bags. Allow the syrup to cool to room temperature. So we have to let it cool too. Okay. Has it been five minutes? We were supposed to steep for five minutes. Wish I could be as cool as you. And I wish I could say the things you do. But I can and I won't live a lie. No, not this time. Chip Zell and Chibi Tech. I don't think I'm familiar. Um, is, what's it? Have you heard of She? I listened to She a lot from the AMV days that I was in. It, but I feel like She is like chip tune. I don't know if that's the same. Shawty is like a melody in my- Hey, what, uh, Monkey, welcome. How are you doing today? Yeah, She, yeah, she, I know She. She slaps. Is she big? I don't know how big she is in that community, but that's that's the primary one that I can think of. So I, oh yeah, like a replay. This song was a certified classic. That girl, that girl is a dime they say. That girl's like a gun to my holster. She's running through my mind all day. Hey, shawty is like a melody in my head that I can't keep up. Oh, got me singing like na 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 every day. It's like my iPod stuck on replay. Oh, what a banger. I miss middle school music. Na 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 every day. It's like my iPod stuck on replay. No clue either. I just listen to stuff I like. That's fair, honestly. Getting rid of my keyboard because of the spacebar. Wait, is the spacebar broken? Sorry, but for a second I forgot that you're LB. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> I, I'm working on getting a V-Roy commissioned. Um, so it might come in like a month or so. We'll see how it goes. Um, but yeah, it's very different. It's a very different setup. Certified hood classic, absolutely. Sorry. All right, I think we're we're good with uh with the T. I'm gonna. We're gonna drain and toss out these tea bags. Shawty is like a melody in my head that I can't keep. Oh, got me singing like na 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 every day. Stuck on replay, replay, replay. Melody, girl, I can write you a symphony. There's a series of TikToks where someone was like, my keyboard doesn't sound right, WASD are fine, but the spacebar is what making me get rid of it. And then he hits a spacebar and the song plays. Wait, oh, really? Wait, what the heck? I haven't seen that. I think we're on different TikToks algorithms. I am very much on... I don't even know what kind of TikTok I'm on. A lot of Avatar The Last Airbender. All right, we're gonna work on the next piece which is 200 grams of sweetened condensed milk. So I need to get a can opener. That I can't keep out, got me singing like na 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 every day. It's like my iPod stuck on replay. Saw it on YouTube Shorts because I don't use TikTok. Oh, I see. It's hard, there's like too many platforms because I'm not on Reels or I don't really watch Reels and I don't really watch Shorts. I literally just watch TikToks. Do you even still have an iPod? I actually don't, but I kind of want one. I feel like it'd be really good for running. Wish right now, could we pretend that airplanes in the night sky are like shooting stars? Oh, wish right now, wish right now, wish right now. I can't rap this. Wait, are there lyrics? Can I like pull up the lyrics and attempt? I feel like this would be a fun song to learn to rap. And all the madness. And call you back, back. The lyrics like phase in and out of my head. What would you wish for if you had one chance? Sorry, I'm late. Don't close that gate. Get back at it by the end of the night. All right, there's like a fly. 
Why is there a fly in my house? Huh. I wish I could do the thing where like you catch flies with chopsticks. That'd be crazy. I could really use a wish right now, wish right now, wish right now. Before I got a job, before I got paid. You could? The song makes me nostalgic for some reason. Or for some recent VTuber stuff, huh? Is this like someone's favorite song? I just really finished the mods to my iPods. Wait, you can mod an iPod? Do you like put a DAC in it or something? All right, we need 200 grams of this stuff. Good thing I have a spoon. You gotta tend that airplanes in the night sky are like shooting stars. I could really use a wish right now, wish right now, wish right now. Airplanes in the night sky are like shooting stars. I wish right now, wish right now, wish right now. Wait, this is a lot of condensed milk. Oh my. My lactose intolerance is not tolerating. Like shooting stars. I could really use a wish right now. All right, we're really close. We're like nine grams off of our target. There we go. I can make your bed rock. Uh, I can make your bed rock. I can make your bed rock. I can make your bed rock. Uh, uh, oh my god, this song was so good. Attractive face. iPod Classic. I replaced the housing, even with the clear one, and replaced the hard drive with an SD card adapter and put an extended battery in there. Oh wait, that sounds so cool. I didn't even know you could mod iPods like that. I heard condensed milk isn't really milk. It's like milk with a lot of sugar in it. I'm swapping between... What am I saying? I'm watching three VTubers. And Chacha's playing with seeds in her game. <laughs> oh, I, wait, what is Chacha playing today? Is she playing a farming simulator? No Stevie Wanda? All right, I think this is the milk tea syrup that we are creating. So I'm gonna mix this up. I'll be stuck to you like glue, baby. Wanna spend it all on you. Baby, a room is a G spot. Call me Mr. Flintstone. I can make your bed rock. 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 Oh my god, Nicki Minaj is on the song. I forgot. RAV tuber, it was a duet between new, two Niji VTubers before everything blew up. Oh, that's sad. They sang airplanes? Well, now there's sentimental value behind airplanes if there wasn't already. You the bestest. Best, bestest. What are these lyrics? Drake's on the song too? Wait, everyone's on the song. But I'm not just anybody. I'm always curious about like Drake as a rapper because I feel like he he does like a rap sing song kind of thing, like a singing rap. I don't know. I feel like it's hard to describe. Baby, wanna be for you like glue. Baby, wanna spend it all on you. Baby, is a G spot. Call me Mr. Flintstone. I can make your bed rock. I can make your bed rock. I can't tell if this is like dissolved already. But I mean the color has definitely changed a lot. I can make your bed rock. Alright, I think this is where we're gonna start making some of the tapioca. I think. I see. So we follow the instructions. Bring the water to a boil, remove from heat, add tea bags, steep for five minutes, remove the tea bags. Um, and then stir in condensed milk. We have to let it cool to room temperature. 
And then now we need cook the tapioca pearls according to the package instructions. And then set aside, okay. So I do think we need to pull the burner bag out, which is a bummer because I, I put it away. <laughs> How much tapioca do you think we need? All right, let's see. This is five servings. It's like 50 grams. We'll try 50 grams. Let me grab the, uh, the burner. Baby, I be stuck to you like glue. Baby, wanna spend it all on you. Baby, my room is the G-spot. Call me Mr. Flintstone. I can make your bed rock. I can make your bed rock. I can make your bed rock, girl. I can make your bed rock. I can make your bed rock. Baby, I be stuck to you like glue. Baby, wanna spend it all on you, baby. G spot, call me Mr. Flintstone. I can make your bed rock. I can make your bed rock. I can make your bed rock, girl. I can make your bed rock. I don't know how much water I need. Hey, I don't know what song's next. Oh, uh, I will say my playlist is really good, but that's because I made it. <laughs> you better move, you better dance. Let's make a night you won't remember. You better get, oh, oh, oh. All right, instructions, boil water. Add tapioca slowly into boiling pot and stir lightly. Wait until tapioca floats to the surface and then cover the pot. This is a lot of steps. Okay, I think we'll just start with the first step which is just boil the water. It's going down. I'm yelling, Timber, you better move. You better dance. Let's make a night. You won't remember. You won't forget. It's going down. Is this not a Ziploc? Oh, shoot. If I open this, it's, it's over. I can't close it. You won't forget. Oh, 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 let's get a, let's get a bowl. Oh, 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 oh. All right. You get the extreme POV of the tapioca. We're going to go for 50 grams. Spin your up round and round. Round and round. It's going down. I'm yelling, Timber, you better move. You better dance. Hey, Pastella, how's it going? Mom, I want to watch Low Battery. Mom, we have Low Battery at home. <laughs> low Battery at home. <laughs> it's a different setup. I promise it's not like this all the time. I'm just vibing today. No pressure. No pressure. Come back with the <laughs> when I'm doing a, like a real stream. <laughs> this is the dollar store Low Battery. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I think I gotta bump up the heat because the water's not really boiling. Oh, it's been so long since I've watched your streams. I didn't expect to see this. I was, yeah, you, you got me, you caught me while I was lacking. This is like my most unprepared 
the most unprofessional stream that I've ever done. I'm just making a cocktail. I'm just trying to have a good time. Oh my god. A million miles away. A message to the man. Oh. It's funny. Well, thank you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Maybe you, you should come back for like one of my cooking streams or something. <laughs> I mean, technically I'm cooking tapioca. Kinda. But yeah, the vertical stream is very new for me. I don't really do the vertical too much. But I like it. I think it's fun. All right, the water is, is getting, get, should I like salt it? Like, like salt bay? <laughs> At least we're not seeing too many confused people here. Yeah, I, I'm kind of glad. Uh, I was worried that it, it would be, I, I'd have to like, explain myself or I'd have to start banning people, but I think we're okay, which I'm grateful for. And I think it's because I'm playing music. But yeah, I just kind of want it to be, you know, a stream of just me hanging out with everybody as I try to make a cocktail. I don't, I've never made a cocktail before, so like this is a really new experience for me. And I feel like I went from like 0 to 100 real fast. Slohan says, well I was confused. <laughs> Wait Slohan, what was the last stream that you went to? Was it Resident Evil? If it, if it was from a Resident Evil stream to this, this is a huge jump. I'm gonna be honest. Uh, 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 also I never play music on stream. I don't, I don't really care today though. I'm just, I'm just here. Mm, mm. I don't know the lyrics to this song. I'm so confused. What is this? An IRL cooking boy? <laughs> Anime boy cooking food? Yeah, pretty much. Last week, I smell food. Hey Friedrich, how's it going? We're making tapioca today. We're doing a cocktail, so it's not really food. It's more of how can I make my alcohol tasty? Do, 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 do. All right, tapioca in. Gonna change my answering machine now that I'm alone. Cause right now it says that we can't come to the phone. I gotta get a spoon. No, it makes no sense. Cause you walked out the door. But it's the only way I hear your voice anymore. It's ridiculous. It's been months. For some reason, I just can't get over us. But I'm stronger than this. Enough is enough. You dancing and vibing to music reminds me of my roommates in uni. Hey, your, your roommates know how to have a good time. <laughs> salt? Do you salt tapioca? I don't really know. So done with wishing she was still here. Said I'm so sick of love songs. So sad and slow. Why can't I turn off the radio? Is he going to share the food with class? If you want some, stop by. I'll give you a sample. <laughs> There's no more anniversary. I'm so fed up with my thoughts of you. It's like boiling a little too much. Every song reminds me of what used to be. That's the reason I'm so sick of love songs. So tired of tears. So done with wishing she was still here. All right, so we wait until the tapioca floats to the top. They're all floating now. Cover the pot and cook on medium for three to five minutes. All right, so I gotta get a lid. Me alone. Stupid love songs. Hey Google, five minute timer. I'm letting go. Oh, hopefully I didn't trigger your Google Homes if you have any. There we go. The last time I drank a cocktail or beer was when I was on a farm with my dad and was like 14. Wait, what? You're exposing yourself. I ain't no snitch, but a good story is a good story. I agree. <laughs> I have headphones. Let's go. Let's go. I feel like headphones are the best viewing experience anyway. But yeah, I don't have a, 
I don't have an Alexa or anything. But I, I do think low key, Alexa is probably the better platform for like home automation because I've been trying to do home automation with the Google Home and it's like, it's kind of annoying. Like it's not, there's not a lot of things you can do with it. HD 560 S's are great. I don't know what I have. Wait, should I? Let me grab my headset. Cause I don't think I've ever shown off my headset. Let me, let me just slip away real quick. I'll be right back. I promise. Oh, there's more Neo. I love it. Dun, 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 dun. I don't know if we have the same head my my headphones are open back I don't know what that I don't know if that means anything I mean there's holes in the back there's a ton of sound leak but I live with by myself so like there's no real issue with it there's something about her ooh there's something about uh, I have these which are the HD 58X's Jubilee. I don't, I don't know. They just look pretty plain, but I like them a lot. I upgraded my ear pads to leather and it's been so, so nice. All right, I'm gonna put these away. <laughs> I, I gotta put them away before I forget. I think they were like a couple hundred dollars, but I've, been, I've had them for a while. And I've never felt the need to like upgrade or anything. They definitely get the job done. That's why I love her, Miss Independent. Won't you come and spend a little time? She's got her own thing. Let's see. In the state of Texas, you can drink alcohol as long as you're on private property and your parents are around. Wait, that's kind of cool. You can just do whatever you want at home. Got a pair of HD 6XXs I use when I want to listen to music. 58Xs are nice too. Went for a 6XX. Uh, oh, wait, they're like more expensive, right? Got the 560S to get more soundstage, I see. Yeah, I'm not that big, of, I, I'm not really big in the audiophile, but I try to get like, I try to go for at least a lot of value. I'm, I'm definitely a value consumer. Like I don't really ever go for the best of the best, but I get what I think to be the best for the money. Like, especially for my microphone and stuff. Cause my microphone is uh, the SM57, which is an instrument microphone, but it sounds good. I never felt the need to get the SM7B, which is apparently the gold standard right now. But uh, hey, I saved myself like 200 bucks. I was looking at the SM58s. Yeah, I think the 58s are pretty versatile too. Uh, I don't really know what the difference in their, um, what's it called their, what, what's it, the sound profile, but I like the 57 for, well, I, I got the 57s because I read somewhere that that's what the president uses during their presidential address. I was like, okay, I might as well get that. It's not that expensive. It was like a hundred bucks. SM58 is an SM57 with a dome and filter. Yeah, I have to get like a separate, separate filter on it. There's been a random hole in my old room since I was four. Did you make that hole? Do you punch a hole in the wall? Just unscrew the top of the SM57, or 58 and it's now a 57. Yeah, I think they use the same, um, is it is it a coil? It's a coil, right? I don't know what it's called. I know nothing about <laughs> audio equipment. I just buy what I think is good. That's why I love her. Yeah, it. I mean, I like the dynamic microphones a lot. I used to have a condenser microphone. I had like the, the AT2030. And it just picked up so much noise around me. I just, I didn't like it at all. No, like a drill hole? Oh. Wait, if you didn't put it there, maybe you should patch that up with like some, some drywall, whatever it's called, paste. Stop. Stop. All right. Our tapioca's done. Usher, usher, usher. Yeah, man. So we back in the club with our bodies rocking from side to side, side, side to side. Thank God the week is done. I feel like a zombie gone back to life, back, back to life. Look at that. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see that. That's our tapioca. It's our boba. 
It actually smells really good. Eyes, 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 eyes. Baby, tonight, the DJ got us falling in love again. Maybe tonight. I gotta strain these out real quick. Falling in love again. So dance, dance like it's the last, last night of your life. Life gon' get you right. Tonight, the DJ got us falling in love again. No tomorrow, that's just right now, 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 now. Gonna burn this mother down, 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 down. All right, there's like one bad tapioca, so I'm pulling it out. Should I, should I just eat it? Should I taste it? I use my headset mic when I stream or game. Yeah, I feel like that's really convenient. I was looking into getting like a, a mod mic. Wow, Meatball. You brought donuts? Hey, Billy, how's it going? If you're demonetized, why not curse too? That's true. I mean, it definitely tastes like tapioca. I don't know what else it would taste like. I try not to curse too much. Like, this is how, that's how I am in person too. I try not to swear a lot. But obviously it slips out. And it comes out when I sing too. The only other holes in my room are from shooting a, a BB gun at cardboard. Oh, I've never owned a BB gun or an airsoft gun or a paintball gun. I think the only thing I've ever had is like a, a Nerf gun. Nerf guns are fun, honestly, but I accidentally hit my brother in the eye with one once. So I, I try to be careful with it. I use Vmoda Boom Pro. Oh, is it an attachable mic too? Is it better than the, uh, the mod mic? The mod mic is the only one that I knew of before. Mm. Mm. So dance, dance like it's the last, last night of your life. Like, gonna get you right. All right, so we cooked the tapioca in a shaker combined vodka, milk, tea, syrup, and half and half with ice. Shake well until chilled and combined. Strain the cocktail over tapioca, serve immediately. Okay, so I have to look for a cocktail shaker. Airsoft fires BBs, oh, I didn't know that. Hey, nice legs, you're baking cookies? Let's go. I want some cookies. It's cheaper than the mod mic and doesn't have a second cable. Replaces the headphone. Oh, wait, that's so convenient then. Oh, you meant airsoft? Wait, you did say airsoft. What do you mean? <laughs> you didn't make a mistake. Oh, this is a banger. Wishing a well, don't ask and I'll never tell. And now you're in my way. <laughs> what a banger. Wait, where's my, do I have a cocktail shaker? Hold on. Let me look around the kitchen. Air stairs holding. I don't know the lyrics to the song. Uh, 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 uh. You think you're going, baby? Hey, I just met you. And this is crazy. Well, here's my number. So call me maybe, and I'll shut down at you, baby. I don't know lyrics. What is the song? Wait, I I thought I had a shaker for sure. It's just missing. Oh, never mind. I found it. But it's high up. I have to get on my chair. Oh God. If I fall and die, you're witnessing a death on stream. All right, there we go. I got it. All right, so this is my little cocktail shaker. It's got like a little contraption for your beverage and then uh, the thingy at the top. Donuts are better than cookies. I would disagree. I like, I like cookies more than donuts. Sorry, Billy. It's just, it's the truth. This is how it is. Hey, I just met you and this is crazy. So here's my number. So call me maybe. At you, baby. So here's my number. So call me, maybe. All right, I don't. The thing is, I don't have like a lid for this thing. Should I just use a shot glass? 
I'll just use a shot glass. Just check. HD58X has one cable to each ear cup, so your only option is mod mic. Oh, that's kind of a bummer. Do you think, I don't know, I have a decent microphone though. I don't mind having a microphone dangling in front of my face. Cause now I've been streaming for so long, it feels weird when I don't have a microphone just sitting in like right next to my mouth. All right, I'm gonna rinse this out cause it looks kind of nasty. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Hey, I just met you. Oh wait, I'm singing the wrong lyrics. So call me maybe. This is crazy. Here's my number. So call me maybe. I hope this tastes good. I'm worried that it's not gonna taste good. So here's our our milk tea syrup. Here's our shaker. Here's our vodka. So we need to get ice. Uh, I'm gonna grab ice from the freezer. I miss you so bad. I just know that I miss you. Wait, do I not have ice? I'm missing an ice tray. Guys, I've been robbed. Someone ran into my house and just stole one ice tray. All right, I got my ice tray. This is my cute little ice tray. You should be fine then. Stick with the microphone. No point spending more money. That's true. Yeah. The only problem is like, I feel like the, the weakness of my setup is actually my microphone arm. Before, whenever I moved it to a spot, like it would just stay in position. Now, if I move it, it would just keep rising up to like its top position. And I had to like, I had to wrestle with it enough so it stays still in one spot. It was really annoying. Might be able to tighten the screw. Yeah, I'll have to give that a shot, honestly. I think it's like, yeah, the tension probably loosened with time. All right, let's put some ice in here. Hard for me to breathe. Tell me how I'm supposed to live with no air. Couldn't be without air. No air, no air. Have you guys been watching any anime lately? I've been trying to get into some more anime, but the only thing I'm watching right now is Mashal. Because I really like Mashal. I'm about to start watching One Piece. My friends really want me to watch One Piece, so I'm like, okay, fine. I'll give in to peer pressure, I'll watch a One Piece, even though it's kind of boring right now. I recommend stealing more ice. Yeah, I might need some more ice. Alright. So the recipe calls for... 60 grams of vodka? That's crazy. It's literally half vodka. All right, we'll try it. Do you expect me? Let me get a cup. Hard for me to breathe. Tell me how I'm supposed to breathe with no air. One Piece is still faster to read. Yeah, I, I just like, they were telling me to watch One Piece in dub so I can do like chores and stuff while watching One Piece in the background. Cause that's how they got into it. So I was like, okay, I'll give it a shot. Like what, what's the harm, right? Okay. So we're gonna go with, I'm scared of like the amount of vodka it's asking me to put in here. I'm gonna put half. We're gonna put 30 grams of vodka and see if we taste it. Two shots of vodka. All right, then we need 30 grams of this milk tea syrup, which is here. I don't know how we're gonna pour this out. I think I just have to like scoop it. This might take a second. No air, no air. I should get like a soup ladle or something. It's okay, we're making progress. No air, no air. All right. And then we need 30 grams of half and half, which I should have in the fridge. 
hard for me to breathe. We got some Walmart brand half and half. I don't watch anime, I doubt whether I'm a weeb or not. I mean, you don't have to watch anime to be a weeb. You just have to like enjoy the media. You don't have to watch religiously. Like I used to watch like all the shows every season, but now I don't have the time for it anymore, honestly. So I just watch what people recommend or what I think looks funny. All right, 30 grams. 30, 30. All right, that's 30, okay. So this is the perfect balance. Equal parts half and half, milk tea, and uh, vodka. Saw a difference between the two other animes openings. I know I have to like watch, I have to find a guy to avoid the One Piece fillers. That's a big thing. I heard someone drop a metal sounding object and just hear them scream. What, really? One Piece kind of switches tone every few arcs. Oh, I see. Well, that keeps it fresh, I guess. All right, how do I do this? In the back of my car, lie their bodies. Is this what a cocktail shaker is? Oh, shoot. Uh, I spilled a little bit everywhere. Let me get a, let me get a paper towel. It's milking everywhere. Yeah, I don't know, like, I, I get a little bit of like One Piece FOMO sometimes, but I I do think the One Piece art is kind of off-putting. Is that like wrong to say, or it's not wrong, it's my opinion, but I think it's like, it's such a weird reason to like not watch a show. All right, so we got our cup. Where's my mind? We got our tapioca. Maybe it's in the gutter where I left my lover. Mm. It's kind of sticky, huh? For Vendetta, thought that I know better, but now I got a belly ache. This is really difficult. The tapioca is so sticky. I feel the same way about Baki's art style at first. Oh yeah, Baki is the, is that the fighting show? Guys, this just looks like normal milk. This just looks like milk. I don't know if this cocktail is gonna be any good. All this work for this. Mine. Maybe it's in the gutter. All right. I have to take lactate first. Thought that I'd feel better, but now I have a belly ache. Ugh. I'm gonna take a sip, see if it's any good. Lactose intolerant streamer can't escape milk. Kind of like boba milk tea with alcohol. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's like literally what it is. All right, I'll try it. Oh, it's disgusting. I hate it. All right, hold on. We have to fix this. We have to fix. I can taste, I can taste the vodka. That's the problem. We're gonna add another 30 grams of this stuff. This looks so sad. And say, hey, that it's too late to apologize. It's too late. I gotta make this taste good. To apologize. It's too late. Okay, so I've doubled the ratio of the of the, the milk tea. I hey Bridget, how's it going? It's good to see you. Hopefully you're doing well today. All right, I'm stressed out, so I got to take a seat. 
I thought it was gonna taste at least decent, but now I, I have to do so much to fix this. I need you like a heart needs a beat. It's nothing new. But yeah, we're making a cocktail today. We're supposed to try to make alcoholic boba. I recommend drinking pilk instead. Honestly, pilk is better than this. Not bad. What if I add 30 grams of half and half as well? Let's try it. I'm just playing around with the ratios until I get it tasting better. I'm so ready for spring break. Let's go. Just woke up from your nap. Let's go. Wait, is your spring break soon? Spring break will be so fun. Yakult with soju and boba. That's true. Maybe I should try that. Maybe I should go for like a fruity flavor instead of a sweet flavor. It's still not there yet. I think I need a three to one ratio of milk tea syrup to vodka. Yeah, let's do, let's try that. We're gonna, we're gonna get this. This is gonna take some time. This is such a terrible way of portioning out your milk tea. I'm leaking everywhere. Oh god, it's leaking. There we go. Alright. That should be 3 to 1 ratio. Let me scoop this up. I used to rule the world. Half and half, one of my many gems in my household, figuratively speaking. Oh, really? Don't worry about incorrect spelling because I can't read. That's true. Making a potion? Kitchen's become an experiment. Yeah, I'm trying to make a good cocktail because um, my friend's throwing a birthday party tomorrow and it's going to be a cocktail party where people are supposed to bring cocktails. And I didn't come up with one, so I'm trying to make one today. I love this song. It's a good song. I love it. Fear in my enemy's eyes. Listen as a crowd. All right, let's taste it. Better, better. We're, we're trending in the right direction. Oh yeah. I gotta write this down on my whiteboard. Three to one ratio, milk tea to vodka with a two to one ratio of half and half to vodka. Let's try that. Let me write it down. So three to one ratio Milk tea to vodka, and then a two to one ratio of, what was it, half and half? Half and half to vodka. And then we just need to make a lot of boba, like a lot of tapioca. I cooked, I cooked. You gonna try another AI recipe? Improvement? Yeah, yeah. It's so much better. It was just definitely just way too much alcohol. Mmm. Yep, this is it. This is the winner. I should try another AI recipe. Should I, try, like, should I submit a picture of what I have in my fridge and have AI try to make something? I think that's not even a bad idea. All right, this is good. What if my friend doesn't like milk tea? Then I'm kind of shit out of luck, right? Some reason I can't explain. This is literally just milk tea with vodka in it. But that was when I ruled the world. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That is some good stuff. Mm, 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 mm. Oh. Mm -hmm. All right. 
what I'm going to do is we're going to try this again with the ratios that we provided. And we're going to see if we can just fill this whole cup. Mm. Who else messes with the Minecraft version of the song? The, honestly, the Minecraft version, it kind of made me cry. The music video is so sad. I really liked it. I'll be cooking something dubious. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, the alcohol might be hitting me a little bit. Honestly, I feel like I could replace the vodka with like soju. You know what I mean? Like, what's the point of vodka? It could be anything, right? As long as it has a very neutral taste. Mm. I cry too at the end. Yeah, the, this is so sad. Oh my god, this song is amazing. You guys know Live in the Vita Loca? She's into superstitions and voodoo dolls. I feel a premonition. Make me call. Mm -mm -mm. I should pull up the lyric version. Okay, honestly though, the best version is the Shrek version. The Shrek version is so good. Take your clothes off and go dancing in the rain. Just take away your pain like a bullet to your brain. Upside, inside out, live in the Vida Loca. Push and pull you down, live in the Vida Loca. Lips are devil red, and your skin's the color mocha. Alright. We'll try this one more time. Let's get some ice. Get some tapioca. We still have some leftover tapioca. See if I can just like drop it in there. Let me take the straw out. Put it off the side. All right, here we go. Tapioca. To my money. Take. Oh wait, the lyrics change, huh? Okay, I forgot how sticky tapioca is. It's kind of gross. Upside, inside out. I suddenly imagine you recreate Numa Numa meme. I haven't heard the Numa Numa song in forever. Oh my, that's such a throwback. Let me get some more ice. And the skin's the color mocha. Living la vida loca. Wait, I might not have any more ice. I have like a, a, a little bit of ice, but mostly it's gone. Girl, close off and go dancing in the rain. Did you take away your pain like a bullet to your brain? Upside, inside out, living the vida loca. All right, that's all the ice I have. Saw devil red and her skin's the color mocha. All right, let's finish off this recipe. All right, so we're gonna need at least, at minimum, 90 grams of this. I feel like I should get like a funnel or something. Live in the Vida Loca. I'm gonna get a funnel. This is so much work. Because it's gonna spill everywhere. Alright. So we need like 90. Ah! That doesn't work. 
I spilled it. Oh my god, it's all over my socks. <laughs> Hold on. Alright, now I gotta I gotta clean this up. Mm. At least the song is good. Uh, uh. Wait, can I play this song on stream? Wait, it's, it's actually like it's kinda nasty. Hold on. <laughs> but it slaps. Are you here right now, huh? It's also all over my jeans. You're here right now, huh? Alright. I might have to hit it with a Swiffer later. Because it might get sticky. Like a mofo. Uh, uh. I can probably make some steps, sisters. Uh. I'm gonna throw away these paper towels. You know. Well, let's take it slow and steady. Condensed milk will be sticky. Yeah, it's gonna be really sticky. There's nothing I can do about it. It's too late. Thinking out loud. Okay, I think what I have to do is I have to put this into like. Do you know about like the, like the squeeze cups, like the sauce cups, or the sauce tubes? I gotta find one of those. Is he here right now, huh? Oh shoot! Alright, that's seventy-five. I floss every day, but I ain't a dentist. I invent it. Cause I meant it. Mm -mm, mm. Alright. I think that's it with a. Uh, I'm gonna put this in the sink because it's like. It's so sticky. Oh, it's so. Ah! It's sticky everywhere. Alright. I think I gotta clean this up real quick. Otherwise, the stickiness will manifest. Ugh. You didn't see my feet, did you? You can't get that for free. Then I eat it in the morning. I haven't heard this song in a while. Yeah, it's pretty old. I just don't know what to call it. I ain't nothing like your last dude. What's his name? Not important. Alright. Chocolate. All right. We redeem ourselves here. So we did 90. And we want 60 of the half and half. All right, that's 60. No foot cam? No. <laughs> no foot cam. It's not that kind of stream. All right, and 30 of this. Almost done. All right, perfect. This is the recipe. I used to work at a boba shop. Wait, really? I feel like working at a boba shop sounds kind of fun, but then once I start working there, I feel like I'll hate it. Whisper goodbye, she got on the plane. Never to return again, but always in my heart. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This love has taken its toll on me She said goodbye too many times before And her heart is breaking in front of me And I have no choice Cause I won't say goodbye anymore This song is so good How tall am I? Um, I'm not short That's all I can say <laughs> For two years? Oh wait, you're the expert. It was fun and a good first job, but I needed to lock in on those nursing apps. 
That's true. I I totally understand that. Pretending to be the same to turn around and leave again. But it do. This love has taken its toll on me. She said goodbye too many times before. And her heart is breaking in front of me and I have no choice cause I won't say goodbye anymore. All right, let's take a sip. Yep, I like this. I don't know if anyone else will like this at the party, but if not, I'll drink this all night. I'll be drinking this all night. My uh, fingertips, every inch of you, cause I know that's what you want me to do. This love has taken its toll on me. She said goodbye too many times before. Mm. 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 Can you guys tell? I'm having a lot of fun today. I think like, for some reason, because this is such like a unscheduled stream, I'm just having so much fun. I don't know, I haven't done this ever. This is so fun. I don't think I'll do it again though. <laughs> the vertical stream is so interesting. Save us some if no one drinks it. I'm sure they'll like it. Yeah, if no one likes it, I'll report back to you guys. Took some time to watch the music video on this love and pause it at certain frames to make out all else that was going on. Oh, was there a lot of stuff going on in the back? I didn't really watch the music video. Never seen the music video? Is graphic? Oh, is it graphic? Maybe I shouldn't watch it then. I, I have a, a weak heart. My heart is very weak. Oh, way too beautiful girl. <laughs> oh my god, I love my own playlist. I am just, I am patting myself on the back. It's like, oh man, who made this amazing playlist? It's me. I made this amazing playlist because it's my playlist. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff going on with that music video for which uh, you needed to pause and see what's going on since you originally saw it from MTV. Oh, that's true. You can't pause the TV like that. Okay, I think this is the recipe. This is, like there's a, a faint, faint touch of alcohol, but I think this, this is the winner right here. So if you guys wanna recreate this at home, three to one ratio of the milk syrup, which is two cups of water, four bags of tea, uh, four bags of black tea, and 200 grams of condensed milk. And then you'll have a two to one ratio of this, half and half. And those numbers are based off of the, how much vodka you're using. So I use 30 grams of vodka, 60 grams of this, and 90 grams of the milk syrup. And chef's kiss. I, I really like this. I think we did an outstanding job. And I think a bulk of the work comes from making, um, actually the tapioca. I think the tapioca here, we don't have very much left, but the tapioca took the, the most effort in this whole entire thing. Go to playlist. Oh yeah, it's great. I made it myself. <laughs> what else is on this playlist? This is a banger. Oh, the next one is is good. Next one is good. I'm gonna sit here and just sip and just enjoy myself. I hope you guys are having a great night though. I know it's Thursday. Um, I usually would be asleep by now, but I really wanted to have something good to take to the the party tomorrow. I, I wanted to show up and impress. I don't know if this is gonna impress, but I'll, I'm happy with this. And I think, I think it shows that I put a lot of thought into it, you know? I, I hope my friend likes it, we'll see. To be fair though, I don't know if my friend likes boba, I should have asked. <laughs> but it's okay, I bet there's at least one person that will like boba there. My middle school, high school playlist, exactly. I, I really like the middle school, high school era of music, 2010, like, yeah, mid-2000s to like mid-2010s, I really like that era of music. Thursday morning? It's Friday morning? It's Thursday night here. It's almost midnight, so it's about to be Friday. Yeah, I was gonna say, um, I was planning on streaming tomorrow, um, but I don't know when I'll be able to stream. 
Uh, I'm going to the dealership tomorrow to see if I can get that motorcycle that I've been looking at. And if it takes too long, I may have to postpone it to like Saturday or something. But I'll keep you guys updated. The schedule might be wrong. But I swear, we will finish Resident Evil 4. I actually really want to finish Resident Evil 4. This is going to take some time. <laughs> oh, you typed wrong? Oh, I see. No worries. Yeah. Wait, how, how far ahead are you? How many hours ahead? It's 11.59 or 11.49 p.m. It's almost 11.50 here. I'm in, um... I was gonna say EST, but we just had daylight savings. So I'm actually in EDT. Once the bike stuff is done, then shall be time for pursuing the streaming on the 2DS. Almost. Uh, mercenary, uh, in terms of like the priorities for my saving stuff, uh, if you were curious, is the motorcycle first, and then um, I got a commission, a 2.0, because I want to get a model upgrade, and that's going to be a bit of money. I have to find an artist and rig. I just have some money set aside for that, and then it's the 2DS. And I think that's, those are my main priorities. Hopefully, I can get this all done this year. It's 850? Really? Oh yeah, wait, Pacific Coast, or West Coast is like what? 8 o'clock? Is it almost 9 o'clock for you guys? Man, I wish it was 9 o'clock here. Do they even make streaming 2DSs? They don't. They don't make them anymore. You have to buy them off the used marketplace. So there's a, a premium. They're, they're really hard to find, so they're really expensive. Almost 9. I'm not gonna lie, I've been considering moving out to the West Coast. I've been thinking about it a lot recently, but I don't know if I'm ready for for something like that. Because like the, the main thing is like, I need I need a job first. <laughs> my job doesn't let me work remote. Oh my god, Conrin! How are you going? How are you doing? It's good to see you. We're we're working on making um a cocktail. I tried to make a uh, a boba tea um, cocktail with vodka. Turns out pretty good. Oregon and Idaho are still the cheapest areas. Really? Wait, what's in Oregon? Portland? P Portland's pretty big, right? Washington is getting worse. Still looking for a job myself. Yeah, I, the job market's really rough right now, honestly. Oh my god, wait, I forgot it's down! Turn this place into your private getaway So leave it behind Cause we have a night to get away Uh, yeah! So come on and fly with me as we make our great escape. This song was so good. I think Jason had a, Jay Sean had like a one hit wonder and it was this song. I don't think he, any of the other music he made ever came close to this song. You won't be lonely. Your playlist is very similar to mine. Let's go. I've been debating on moving to the West Coast too. Yeah, I just like, I don't know. I feel like the, the community on the West Coast is way more like, Tight knit. Like, there's a lot of, especially content creators, there's a lot of content creators out on West Coast. On East Coast, like, there's nobody here. <laughs> I don't know anybody here in terms of, like, that streams. I, I have friends here, I have family here. But I don't have streamer friends here. I wanna be where. Wait, what's the. What's the. How's that little mermaid song go? I wanna be where the people are. <laughs> Skip Portland. Is a dumpster fire? Wait, really? I thought it was a pretty major city. Lil Wayne is on this song, right? Yeah, it is. It's Lil Wayne. If you want to live in a smaller town, cities of Oregon and most around Portland, I see. East Coast isn't bumping? Yeah. Also, East Coast is like, by the time you're going to bed, everybody starts streaming. Like, I want it to be 9 o'clock. It's midnight, <laughs> almost. California is just too expensive, though. I don't think I can justify California. California cost of living is so high. And you guys get taxed so much. Like, I understand you make more on average, but still a lot of money. You might as well move to Coma, Dali City, or other small town area. Yeah. Are there tech jobs in those areas, though? Dali City is just south of SF. Oh, really? Is it still considered part of the Bay? I think, honestly, low-key, I wouldn't mind Seattle. Oh, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, want to, but I can't help it. I love the way it feels. It's got me stuck between my fantasy and what is real. I need it when I want it. I want it when I don't. Tell myself I'll stop every day knowing that I won't. I got a problem and I don't know what to do about it. I love this song. I think this is my all time favorite song ever. Taken by the thought of it. And I know this much is true. Baby, you have become my addiction. I'm so strung out on you. I can barely move, but I like it. And it's all because of you. And it's all because of you. And it's all because of you. And it's all because never get enough. She's the sweetest drug. This song makes me sad for no reason. <laughs> I'm like in my feels. Dali City is the bay? Okay. Bay is split into SF, Peninsula, South Bay, and East Bay. I don't know, I feel like Seattle would be nice because it's rainy, right? Oh, Seattle Sketch? I love this song. Why are our playlists the same? Wait, Bridget, you gotta send me your playlist. Maybe I should steal your songs. Bellevue may be fine. Don't get drunk yet before the party. I know, but this alcohol is hitting. Do you guys know how strong vodka is? This stuff is 40% alcohol. <laughs> and I know this much is true. Baby, you have become my addiction. I'm so strung out on you. I can barely move. But I like it. And it's all because of you. Man, I wish I had the voice or like the vocal range of like a tenor because then I could sing so much pop music But I'm I'm a baritone So like m my voice doesn't fit in the range of a lot of pop music like I can never sing Justin Timberlake Okay, I send it in discord later. All right sounds good. I'm looking forward to it No doubt. Speaking of which um, there's a, a music festival that I really want to go to and the tickets are sold out and I'm debating whether I want to buy resale prices. It's, it's in Vegas, it's called Lovers and Friends and it's an R&B and hip hop festival. I really want to go. Wait, let's look, let's look at the artists that are going. It's crazy. Like I'm about to sell my left kidney to go, honestly. Lovers and Friends in Vegas. Like I really want to go. I want to go so bad. Okay, there's a lot of things I want to do this year. Okay, first of all, one, I want to get that new motorcycle. Two, I want to commission a new model. Three, I got to get a 2DS. Four, I want to go to Lovers and Friends. Five, I want to get a tattoo. <laughs> so like, I, I'm spending so much money this year. Okay, so Lovers and Friends. This is how stacked the lineup is. You have Alicia Keys. Snoop Dogg, Gwen Stefani, Usher, Lil Wayne, Nelly Furtado, Usher, did I say Usher? Backstreet Boys, Ludacris, Neo, Akon, T-Pain, Sierra, Timbaland. Oh, this, this lineup is so good. They even have Ayaz. You get to listen to replay live. Shawty's like a melody in my head. <laughs> like, I want to be there so bad. <laughs> I don't know about like some of these other ones. I don't know. Oh, Mario is going to be there. That's going to be sick. Um, some of these I don't really know. Rick Ross. Jeremy. Lupe Fiasco is going to be there. Mostly, I mostly want to see Neo. Neo is going to be there. And that's like, that's all I need. Neo and Lil Wayne are going to be there. That's mm, such a good lineup. Lovers and Friends is a go-to song as well. I agree. That's rough, buddy. Make sure you get a new 2DS, 3DS and not the old one. Oh, that's true. I gotta get the new one. Um, but yeah, I think the priority is probably to get the 2DS sooner rather than later because as time goes on, they get more rare, right? But I also want to get like an IRL streaming setup. I want to do so much stuff. <laughs> I'm so poor. I'm not poor. 
I, I have a place to myself. <laughs> I'm just, it's like an expression. Like, I just, there's all these things I want to do and I, I have to be smart about how I spend my money. That's what I should say. I'm not poor. Please don't pity me. I'm doing fine. <laughs> yeah, I feel like there's like a lot of things that I've been thinking about. I've been like deep in my thoughts, you know? I think it's the alcohol. But like, I was thinking if I ever had the opportunity to make content full time, I don't know if I would do it. Like, I honestly don't know if I would, I would, because my biggest fear is if it's turning something I love into a job. And then it, at that point, it's no longer something I love. Like I've experienced it before. I used to enjoy coding a lot and like developing software. And now it's, it's such a chore. Like I can't even be bothered to think about coding outside of work. You took that back so fast. <laughs> yeah. I know it's just, I wanted to clarify because I don't, I don't need anybody's pity. That's, that's the thing. I, I'm, I'm just being honest. <laughs> New TDS is the way to go, but keep in mind you may need to replace the screws since Nintendo bought, brought back the tri-wing screws. Oh no, I hate the proprietary like hardware stuff. Coding is crazy. You're so smart. No, okay. <laughs> Coding is like, I, I don't think I'm smart. <laughs> Or I'm not, I don't think I'm as smart as some people. Some of my coworkers are crazy. Um, in, in a good way, not crazy in a bad way. But like, I know there are people out there that are really passionate. They go to work, they code. They go home and they work on a coding project. I can't, I could not do that. I go home and I think about streaming. I care about my streaming a lot. <laughs> but yeah, living is just expensive. I wish existing didn't cost so much money. <laughs> existing is like, it's so expensive. It's like food, shelter. I don't know, and like heat, I feel like that's important too. And like transportation, like having a car is so expensive. Like I own my car, right? I'm, I don't have a loan on it and I'm still paying like a hundred dollars a month, over a hundred dollars a month, just in insurance and putting aside some money in case like I need a repair. Okay, hold on. It's, it's about that time. I got to sneeze pretty soon. So I got to go blow my nose and you can't listen to that for free. So I'm gonna mute real quick and I will be right back. I'm gonna slip away. I'm back. Insurance is expensive. Yeah, insurance is really expensive. And like, I'm fortunate that like the insurance here isn't even that expensive because I don't live in a city where there's like a lot of accidents. Bless you, thank you. Living in a non-walkable city is painful. Yeah, I want to live in a walkable place. Like if I could get everywhere I needed to on foot and with like a bicycle, I would love that. Where I am, vertical stream feels weird. Hi Lex, it's good to see you. Yeah. Usually, like, I don't usually do vertical streams. This is my first, my first ever vertical only stream. Oh, but yeah, I, I think I was saying, I think I might have like some sort of health condition. <laughs> I don't know what it is though. Cause every time, like in my day to day, like I don't get congested, but when I start streaming and when I start talking for a long time, like I get a lot of congestion, like a lot of mucus buildup. I don't know why. And I was like, I was trying to find out like what could possibly cause this, right? Because like I'm at my computer all day and I don't have any issues, but the moment I start streaming and talking, it gets, it gets really bad. So like, I'm trying to figure out like, it's, it's not like dust because if it was dust, I would be congested all the time. So I feel like it's, there's something that's happening with me. Like when I talk, where my body feels like it needs to produce more mucus. Why are you wearing glasses my entire life? is like, oh, wait, you saw, oh, I forgot. I forgot that you can see. Wait, I'm not wearing glasses. What are you talking about? Okay. I think you guys know, I wear glasses on weekdays and on weekends I wear contacts. Cause on the weekends, I don't want to carry around my glasses everywhere. But like on the weekdays, I'm going into the office for work. Like, and if I have contacts in, it really like strains my eyes to stare at a screen all day with contacts. 
So if, I, if I'm out there touching grass, I'll wear contacts. If I'm at home, minding my business, I'm wearing glasses. Living in a walkable place is amazing. Wish I was in one. Yeah, I feel like... I think I want to move into a, like a major city. I'm not living in a major city right now. So like... I feel like there are just more opportunities to do things in major cities. We don't talk anymore. We don't talk anymore. We don't talk anymore like we used to do. You only have glasses? Honestly, I think getting contacts is really a really nice option to have. I think it's really fun. Like it's kind of a pain in the butt to put your contacts in, but like I feel, I don't know why, I just feel way more confident about myself when I have contacts. So like, for example, like when I go on dates, I, I'm, not, I'm never wearing glasses. I always have contacts in. Or what, when I'm going out, uh, like what, if you see me at an anime convention, 100% I'm wearing contacts. I'm not wearing glasses. Like if I'm out and about, I am wearing glasses. Or not wearing glasses, I'm wearing contacts. I stay quiet this whole time. You're reminding me to put some songs on my playlist. Yes, steal my music. I love to share. <laughs> we don't talk anymore. As a silly, I'm the opposite. I feel better with glasses because it hides my nose. Oh, really? I think it's, for me, it's because I've worn glasses like all my life. And I only recently got contacts. I got contacts within the past four years. So I've only worn contacts for four years. Kind of like in the manga I read. Contacts scare me. The thought of just putting something in your eyes. Yeah, it, it was really hard to get used to at first. It took me a couple months to get used to. I'm not gonna lie. This boba is so good. I'm so proud of myself. I didn't expect it to turn out this well. I think it gets better as the ice melts because it gets more diluted. Contacts is scary. The thing is though, I really like the idea of colored contacts. I think I mentioned this before, but I, I really want to get into cosplay this year. And so like, I feel like having the having contacts will make it my cosplay is more, not more impressive, but more realistic. I feel like it's part of the process, right? Because not all characters are going to wear glasses. The Mashal cosplay will eat. Yeah, I'm so excited. I have to make fake dumbbells though. I, I think I'm going to make like a, a barbell out of like a PVC pipe and some styrofoam. And hopefully it doesn't break in transit. I, the thing is like, in terms of cosplay, I'm more interested in prop making than I am in like making clothes. Cosplaying is fun. I've cosplayed like very casually before. Like I've cosplayed Haikyuu. I've cosplayed, um, I don't remember his name. Do you guys remember the the guy from from uh, Food Wars? The fish guy with like the red bandana? The Nakari Alice's assistant? Kurokiba, that's his name. I cosplayed him as well. I want to get contact, contacts too for cosplay, but I just go blind for him because my nails are too long. Oh no! I wonder if there's like a, a device that will just put contacts in for you. I feel like that'd be so funny. There's there's a demand. There's there's a demand. We we have to fill the market with some supply. <laughs> Maybe I like it. No way you move on the floor. Come on and give me some more. Streaming like never before. I, I I like it. I think there are. Wait, really? I, I did not think that was a thing that existed. Every time I cosplay, I always cross dress. Honestly, I I'm I've been curious about cross dressing too. The thing is, I don't have like big bedoinka doinks, right? Also, I don't even know who I'd want to cosplay as from the other gender. Do you watch Run With Wind? Not yet, but I have it on my two watch list. For taking them out? Oh, there's a thing for taking them out? Yeah. Well, taking them out is easier than putting them in. I think it depends. If it makes you feel good, I, there's nothing wrong with cross-dressing. I have friends that cross-dress. Maybe I like it, the way you move on the floor. 
Come on and give me some more. Dreaming like never before. This is this is Enrique Iglesias. Really, I found putting it in easy, but taking it out was pain. Oh, I see. I mean, taking it, putting it in takes, I think, three times as long. Cause I I get nervous, right? My hands are like naturally pretty shaky. Like I wanted to be a dentist, uh, growing up, but then I realized like I can't keep my hands steady, and like the more I focus on my hands, the more nervous I get. So the shakier they get. So I'm like, there's no way I'm, I'm like operating on anybody. That'd be so dangerous for me and them. Cause I, I just can't keep my hands steady. I don't know why. This is how I've always been. Oh my God. What's the, what's the next song? Who, who made this immaculate playlist? This gotta be a banger next. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Hall of Fame by the script. Man, I should just pull up the karaoke. Oh, I, I broke it. I, I'm playing at like 10, 10.10. There we go. Uh, uh, uh. Geeking over his own playlist. Who wouldn't? Honestly, who wouldn't? Okay. Do you guys want some discovery? So these are all, this is my playlist of songs that I can sing to, that I know, kind of know. But there's been a lot of cool music that I've been like discovering recently. I don't know the lyrics to. But I think it's like there's this Thai singer that I really like recently called Gal Chani, and she's really good. I like her music. Um, what else? I've been in a pretty big. I've been in a K-pop mood lately. So like in my car, I listen to a lot of K-pop. Let me check my my life list. Yeah, there's a lot of K-pop. Oh my God, there was this this song came up. Uh, like last week, and I've been listening to it non-stop. What's your favorite K-pop group? Okay, so I'm... <laughs> I'm a little basic, but... I really like BTS, but old BTS. As in, like, there's there's an era of BTS that I really like. It's called... They released two albums back-to-back -back called The Most Beautiful Moment in Life Part 1 and Part 2. I really like those. And then, um... I, I like them all the way up until they released something called... Uh, a song called, uh... What's it called? Um, Blood, Sweat, and Tears. That's the last song that I really like from them. And after that, um, I haven't really connected with their music as much. BTS is goaded. Yeah, they're really good. And their new music is good too. It just doesn't connect with me uh, as much as their older songs did. It's always the same five songs over and over. Oh, you always like the same songs? You gotta diversify. I, I really like discovering music, which is why like, I really love when people share their playlists. Because like, it gives me the opportunity to find new, new music. So this is the song that came up the other day that I've been listening to nonstop, which was like hella throwback. Mm. This song is so good. I forgot how good this was. Feel so right. Oh. Oh. Uh. Oh, whoa. Step to the beat of my heart, I don't. <laughs> Honestly, I really like Justin Bieber. I have a good friend who's BTS ARMY. Yeah. BTS fans are crazy, not gonna lie. They are very passionate. I don't need too much, just somebody, somebody to love. I promise you, I swear, somebody to love. I need somebody, I, I need somebody. I need somebody, I, I need somebody. Thanks for hanging out, Slow Hand, I appreciate it. Have a good night. It's good to see you. Old JB is really good. Okay, okay, low key. Do you want me to tell you, one of my favorite artists is Jason Derulo. I really like Jason Derulo. Wait, is he going into Lovers and Friends? I actually don't know. Hold on. Let me double check. Do you want this attention? I just need somebody to love. I think it's so funny that Jason Derulo throws his name into every song. 
nothing else I promise girl I swear I just need somebody to love oh. Wait, did he back out? I, I need somebody I guess he's not there I really want to see Jason Derulo live But he's not touring in the US right now It makes me really sad I can bring, bring you the finest things, yeah Hi Darkest, how's it going? A man of culture? You love Jason Derulo as well? Jason Derulo is one of my favorite pop artists. I think he does he does some of the best sampling. Cause he samples a lot of music. He's cause like what? He sampled um Emogen Heap in What You Say. Uh he recently sampled what's his name? Michael Buble. Have you guys heard his new song? He he samples spicy margarita and it's actually kind of good. Wait, let me let me play it for you guys. I need somebody. I I need somebody. After the song, maybe. I I need somebody. I need somebody. I I need somebody. What drink are you having? It looks delicious. I made a cocktail today. I made um boba. It's a uh, alcoholic boba. So we made um black tea. We mixed in some condensed milk. And then we put in some half and half, and then we put in some vodka, and th that's what this is. Uh, and if you want the recipe, it's a three to one ratio of milk tea um, to vodka, and then a two to one ratio of half and half to vodka. And I've been sipping on this, and I'm feeling really good. This is tasty, and it gets you messed up in just the right ways. So tipsy, th this is a tipsy LB stream, 100%. 100%. I don't know the lyrics, but it sounds good. Make me sing. Oh, make me sing. Jason Derulo is so good. Shot for shot for shot for shot. It looks like lemonade. Oh, no, it's milk tea. It's like, it's very, like, milk colored. It's creamy. What if I turn off this light? Can you see it better if I turn this light off? Ugh, where's the switch? I'm looking for it. All right, see, I turned the light off now. Oh, shoot! I spilled the... Uh... Guys, I think I might be drunk. I gotta clean up after myself. <laughs> Make me sing. You're the only one I want. He might be just a little bit, just a tiny bit. Shot for shot for shot for shot. Oh, is the Apple Music algorithm good? As you guys know, I'm a YouTube Music user. I used to use Spotify a lot, but I couldn't justify paying for Spotify Premium and YouTube Premium at the same time. If it makes you feel better, Jason is afraid of snakes, like you are afraid of spiders. I'm glad that someone fears just as much as I fear. Can't go wrong with Splatoon music. That's true. Video game music is really good. Don't forget to drink water. You're right. I'll drink water after this. I pay for Apple One, so Apple Music comes with that. Yeah, I think that makes sense. I feel like if you're using another service and there's a bundle, like there's no point in buying another service. I do get a little bit of FOMO though. I get FOMO when everyone posts their Spotify wrapped. I'm like, oh, I want a Spotify wrapped. Side order music is good. Industrial music, EDM. I do love some good EDM. I merely sail the seas for music. That's true. The problem is, sailing the seas doesn't really help you discover music. And I, I paid for Spotify Premium so I could find more music because they have a decent discovery algorithm. There I want you to, so put it on me. 
Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, so all this new music that I've been enjoying, I don't know the lyrics to. Let's listen to some K-pop, huh? Ah, oh, shoot, where's the... Ugh, excuse me, I burped. YouTube has a rap. It does have a rap, but it's... it's I don't think it's as detailed as uh, Spotify rap. You have both? Really? Do you mostly use Spotify or YouTube music? Is YouTube premium worth it? I like it a lot. It's because I watch a lot of YouTube on my TV. And on your TV, you can't really have ad block. And so YouTube premium helps a lot with that. I discover music via YouTube and then make decisions. That's fair, yeah. It's also very cost effective. You like K-pop? Of course I do. Who doesn't like K-pop? <laughs> Guys, I don't know if you know, but I'm Asian. <laughs> so I, I like K-pop. There's a good chance I would like K-pop. My attempt at Spotify did not work for me. Oh, that's fair. I miss Google Play Music. I never really used Google Play Music. But yeah, it's definitely not detailed. I mostly use Spotify, but when I want to listen to VTuber covers while I run, I use YouTube Music. Oh, that makes sense. There's not a lot of, I guess like sometimes people will upload on YouTube and it won't be on Spotify. I do like YouTube music in the sense that you can listen to YouTube videos with YouTube music. So their, their music library is way larger because you don't have to go through a distributor. Like if it's a YouTube video, you can listen to it on YouTube music. Most of my songs are hardcore at EDM. Yeah. I, I do enjoy a little bit of um, EDM. I actually am a pretty big, I'm really big on EDM. The problem is like, you can't really sing along to a lot of EDM music. I would listen to K-pop more if I knew any other bands besides BTS. But I can put you on some music. Let me check my playlist real quick. So I've been listening to this song a lot, which is also K-pop. Where is it? This one, I've been listening to this one recently. There's a group I really like called Monster X. Monster X has a lot of great collabs with um, with actually Western artists. Let me show you. Uh, they have a song with Steve Aoki called Play It Cool. And it's actually in English. So this is um, Monster X. But the song is entirely in English, but it's still K-pop. And I really like it a lot. I don't know the lyrics though. Do you like new jeans? Oh, of course I love new jeans. Uh, although I am really, I have a bias. I really like boy bands more than I like um, girl groups. But I like new jeans. Uh, the Seraphim is growing on me. And I like Red Velvet for girl groups. Oh, also, Ive. Ive is pretty good too. Dancing on my face, I was just play it cool. Oh, I'm the opposite? You for girl groups? Oh, I see. Cool. This stream is getting taken down for sure. I'm, I'm playing so much copyrighted music. <laughs> Something like the Beatles and Backstreet Boys or some boy band. I, I like boy, band, boy bands a lot, yeah. What song is this? It's Monster X, it's so good. It's called Play It Cool. I really like Monster X. If I can get more people into Masa X, I would be so happy. You're now stealing it? Let's go! In my face and now just play it cool. It's so good! It's a collaboration with Steve Aoki, so you know it's good EDM. Let's take me moving on. Where you take me moving on? Oh, I said I was gonna drink water, so I gotta get some water. 
I'm gonna get a fresh cup for it. Cool. Cool. I'm trying to see if you can see my earring. It, it's kind of hard to tell, but I do have a dangly one. But that's because I was out earlier today. You guys see that? It, it's kind of hard to see, but it's moving. Stay hydrated. I saw it a bit, but I wasn't gonna point it out. <laughs> I I really like earrings. I like shopping for earrings. I like jewelry. If you couldn't tell, I got my ring. I got my necklace. <laughs> I've got my earring. <laughs> All right. I before my music starts having a mind of its own, I gotta play something else. Let's see. This is a different playlist. This is not my throwback playlist. Oh my god, this song was the GOAT back in the day. This is by Infinite. This is back in K-pop. You love Madison Beer? Yeah, she's really good. You need a bracelet to complete it all? Yeah, I know. The only problem is like, I have an Apple Watch. And I feel uncomfortable having too many things on my wrist. The Apple Watch is practical, but it doesn't look that great, honestly. Alright. I, I need music I can sing to because I, I need to let out all my my stuff. Careful, yeah. I, it, I think it's black right now. Like, it's it's off. I think it's on, like, sleep mode or something. Here we go. I know what you mean. I have an Apple Watch, and I take it off because I don't want to go. It Because <laughs> it doesn't go with the fit. Exactly. I don't know the lyrics to the song. I... I gotta pull it up. Yep, on I, one in a million, my lucky strike. She got me, she got me, she got me bad. This is what it sounds like. Oh. Is this a huge black block on my wrist? Yeah, it's so chunky. It's so like I I've been running a lot, so I use it to track my heart rate, but oh man. Like if I'm going to an event, like I, I want a real watch. <laughs> or or something. But yeah, I I haven't found my my bracelet style yet. I don't know what I like to wear on my wrist, but I like dangly earrings. I know I like that. And I like necklaces that have some sort of pendant or something. My love me rockin', keep me up all night. One in a million, my lucky strike. I usually wear an Apple Watch, but if I were to stream, I'd probably swap it out. Yeah, I actually don't have any analog watches. I definitely need to get some. This is what it sounds like. Tapioca. I've been wearing watches for over 20 years. Oh my goodness. What kind of music do you blast in your car? I usually let the algorithm decide what plays in my car. Which is embarrassing because if I'm driving people around, I get some weed music sometimes and I have to like justify it. Like, oh, don't worry, it's, it's, it's VTuber music. She's a really good singer. <laughs> like, I wear NATO straps. Wait, what's a NATO strap? Is that stainless steel? Bridget says my mom usually buys my jewelry. I'm lazy, but looking for jewelry is nice. Yeah, I, I enjoy shopping for jewelry, but jewelry is expensive. Do I need to show my watch collection? Oh, it's nylon? I see. Yeah, if you have pointers or like any recommendations for beginner watches, I would love that. Iris is a good singer. I would agree. I really like pop. Poppy music though, pop sounding music. So I think out of uh, the Hollow Live talents, I enjoy Kiara's music the most. Her music is the most pop like to me, pop EDM. 
I really like that genre of music. Out of curiosity, will you do any more tofu recipes? Um, the last tofu recipe I did, I didn't really like it. I, I find tofu, tofu to be a really hard ingredient to work with. I don't think it's likely that I'll do more tofu recipes. But I can try. Do you prefer necklaces or rings? I prefer rings. I have more rings. I had to tell myself to stop wearing so many rings. So I, right now, I limit myself to wearing two rings at a time. So I'll usually have a ring on this index finger and I'll have a ring on this pinky. If mechanical, a cheap Seiko 5 would be great. If quartz, mostly, honestly, Timex. Casios. I've been looking. Um, what is your opinion on the Orient Bambino? Because I feel like that comes up constantly when I look up beginner watches. What's wrong with having a ring? There's nothing wrong with it. I like them. Casio has de decent watches for the price. Even Bill Gates uses them to save money. Oh, I didn't know that. What about brass knuckles? Uh, I don't know if brass rec knuckles go well with my attire. I wouldn't mind them though. You're the best I ever had. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I feel like pepper spray is probably more effective than brass knuckles for self-defense. I'm not really a good puncher, you know? Look at me, I'm scrawny. I don't mind that style, but I don't know how I feel about Orient as a brand. Oh, I see. Is Orient like a, it's not an established brand or have they just come onto the scene recently? I thought it was a division of Seiko. This song feels so old, I know. But it's like, I think this album is one of Justin's best albums. I really like this album. Is it? I'm pretty sure. Is Orient a budget brand? I, there's no way I'm, I'm making this up, right? Let me see. Is Orient a part of Seiko? Orient is owned by Seiko. Yeah, they're owned by Seiko. They are entirely owned by Seiko, yeah. They were bought out by Seiko though. So they were an established company, but they were bought by Seiko. So maybe that's like the big differentiation, right? It's not a division, but it's like a company that was acquired by Seiko. Don't let you down. Is it too late to say sorry now? I think my favorite song off this album is What Do You Mean? Which is this one. Huh. If you guys can't tell, my computer is like right here. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, 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 when you nod your head yes, but you want to say no. What do you mean? Oh, yeah. I want an Omega Speedmaster. In terms of like investments, watches are a pretty good store of money, right? I feel like people talk about Rolexes all the time. I don't know very much about watches though. Oh, 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 what do you mean? What do you mean? You're so indecisive, what I'm saying. Trying to catch the beat, make up your heart. Don't know if you're happy or complaining. Don't want for us to end, where do I start? Who's gonna go to the left and one turn right? Argue all day, make love all night. Rolex is insane. You can't even buy them new. Wait, really? Are they like very exclusive with who they even do business with? That's crazy. That's why expensive. They won't even let you buy one. Oh, I see. That's kind of wild. I guess there's a level of prestige that comes with that. But you tell me to go. What do you mean? Oh, I forgot to put the half and half in the fridge. What do you mean? Oh, 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 what do you mean? Hold on, let me get the Swiffer, because the floor is sticking up. When I'm leaving... Uh, da, da, uh, 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 uh. Wait, where's my Swiffer? Swiffer! 
First you wanna go to the left, then you wanna turn right Argue all day, make love all night Up and you're down and in between What do you mean? I got my Swiffer But you wanna say no, what do you mean? You have to have a relationship with an authorized dealer before they even put you on the wait list? That's crazy! You have to go gray market or used. Wait, so there's probably like, you can probably make so much money being a Rolex reseller. Not the sticky floor. You ate the Swiffer? No! Yeah, I feel like if you, if you make it onto the Rolex wait list and you just start reselling Rolexes, couldn't you make so much money? What you tell me to go, what do you mean? I'm just gonna sit down and Swiffer. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. <laughs> merrily, 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 merrily. Life is but a dream. If they catch you, you're screwed? Oh, I see. So you can't like do it purposely. Beautiful girls all over the world I could be chasing but my time will be wasted They got nothing on you, baby Nothing on you, baby They might say hi and I might say hey But you shouldn't worry about what they say Cause they got nothing on you baby Nothing on you baby Hey Where I'm coming from Regardless of the things in the past that I've done This song is so good Oh my god I forgot how good this song was No direction just trying to get some More than I ever won and honestly, I ended up with none. There's so much nonsense, it's with my conscience. But maybe I just let it out. I don't want to sound redundant, but I was wondering that we should let it go. Be a TV episode. Just let it go. Go, go, go. Beautiful girls all over the world. I could be chasing, but my time will be wasted. They got nothing on you, baby. Nothing on you, baby. They might say hi, and I might say hey, but you shouldn't worry about what they say, cause they got nothing on you, baby. Nothing on you, baby. The Swiffer mic. <laughs> Be another one. I've been around and there's never been another one. What happened to B.O.B.? Does he still make music? Baby, you the whole package. Plus you pay your taxes. <laughs> That's the important part, paying your taxes. Now think about it. Been to London, I've been to Paris, even way out there in Tokyo. Back down to the Georgia, to New Orleans. Didn't show. Girl, you got me froze. Like a Nintendo 64. <laughs> That's such a good line. No, no, no. Beautiful girls all over the world. I could be chasing, but my time will be wasted. They got nothing on you, baby. Nothing on you, baby. They might say hi, and I might say hey, but you shouldn't worry about what they say, cause they got nothing on you, baby. Nothing on you, baby. Yeah. Everywhere I go, I'm always hearing your name. No matter where I'm at, girl, you make me want to sing. This song is so good! <laughs> or a car or a train. No other girls in my brain. And you the one to blame. Uh. <laughs> Wait, should I get a snack? I'm a little hungry. I'm a... I'm what you would call... Peckish? 
I may be a little drunk. I got some Oreos. I'll be right back. And I might say, hey, but you shouldn't worry about what they say. So I've got like a, a new type of Oreo that I've never had before. Because I accidentally ate all my Thin Mint ones and I went to the store and they didn't have any. So I have these. These are uh, peanut butter Oreos. <laughs> They're not that bad, but I like the mint ones more. The mint ones taste way better than the peanut butter ones. But I'm gonna be eating these. I'm having a good time. <laughs> I didn't even know they made peanut butter Oreos. It's like, I feel like that's like a weird flavor to have Oreo filling. Oh, oh, oh. it's Mr. Steal Your Girl. It's Mr. Steal Your Girl. Hey Muse, I just had, I made a, a boba cocktail and it's delicious. And now, oh shoot. And now I have to drink water. Hold <laughs> your hands up. <laughs> Tear this club up, bottoms up, bottoms up, up. Throw your hands, oh shoot, that's the wrong lyric. Or you always have a bunch of others that no one recalls. Wait, what's like the weirdest Oreo flavor? Uh, I don't know the lyrics. Tell me what you think. Tell me what you drank. Okay, I gotta go to the next song. All around the world, can you hear me? City to city. Wait, there are Japanese Oreos? No way. Oh, this is a, a banger. I did it again, so I'ma let the beat rock. Oh my, baby, let me love you down. Uh, wait, I haven't even eaten an Oreo. Baby, I can break it down. Got me like, oh my god, I'm so in love. I found you finally. Oh, 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 no, oh, 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 my god. Too many different flavors list out. Sounds delicious. It is great. I followed a recipe and the recipe was bad. So we spent the entire stream tweaking the ratio and we figured it out. The best ratio is for for every gram of vodka, you want three grams of milk tea and two grams of half and half. And it's perfect. The hardest part is making the tapioca. Picturing tumble break dancing the medieval covers of this music, that would, that would be amazing. Am I tumble? There's no way, right? Like, Tumble is kind of based off of me, but it's not entirely based off. He might be drunk me. Tumble is me when I'm drunk. So maybe, if you guys don't know, Tumble is my, my character in D&D. And he is a, a breakdancing berserker who has the spirit totem of a bear. Boba is time consuming to make. Yeah, tapioca, honestly, it was, it was actually pretty involved. So I really hope that my friends like the cocktail that I bring. So the background is tomorrow is my friend's birthday and they invited me over to participate in a cocktail uh, party event. So everyone is supposed to make a cocktail and share it with everybody. And I wanted to make something that was inspired by Boba. So that's why today we were just experimenting and trying to figure out what tastes best to make a Boba cocktail. d is so fun, I haven't played so long. I'm 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 essentially an amateur. I still don't know a lot of the rules, but I've been learning a lot about D&D and it's been really fun. Tumble is absolutely drunk you. <laughs> you were drinking vodka? Yeah. Vodka was in my um it was in my my boba. It's part of my boba cocktail. Although I don't know if vodka was necessary, I probably could have just used soju. I need an Oreo. Well, I already bit this one, but you guys can have a fresh one. Here we go. Enjoy. Bo 
Bubble cocktail sounds crazy. It's surprisingly good. I do think soju would taste better. Because th this has like a taste. I feel like soju doesn't really have that much of a taste. There's so many ways to love ya. Okay, Loki, I really miss the Black Eyed Peas. The Black Eyed Peas, where'd they go? I miss you so much. Soju with a fruit tea and light tea. Oh my god, that would be so good. We have to we have to experiment with more soju cocktails. I'll get more ingredients next time and we'll we'll play around with it. I don't know if it'll be a vertical stream. Maybe. I mean this stream is gonna be taken down anyways. I'm playing so much copyrighted music, there's no way this stays up. Being in the kitchen, making random stuff in the middle of the night sounds fun. Yeah, and it's even better when you're drinking. <laughs> Absolutely. I went to Chick-fil-A the other day and the employee asked our favorite Black Eyed Peas songs. No way, really? I like the song that goes, I'm a B, I'm a B, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a B. <laughs> What's next? Oh, the next song is great. Here we go. Uh, uh, uh. No fighting. Dance like this. Speak Spanish. Como se llama? Bonita. Shakira, Shakira. Oh baby, when you talk like that, you make a woman go mad to be one. My hips don't lie, I'm starting to feel it's right. Attraction. This is perfection. This song is actually such a banger. Anyways, I'm sitting back down because I'm tired. <laughs> Guys, I have work tomorrow. I can't believe it's almost one. How long have I been streaming? This was supposed to be like a 30 minute stream. Dance like this, make your mama speak Spanish. Como se llama, si, bonita. Shakira, Shakira. You talk like that, you make a woman go mad. Imagine going to your house and seeing LB with a broom singing to a Shakira song. Hey, I, would, I wouldn't be upset. Time flies when you're having fun, that's true. Like, I wish I could do karaoke streams with like the actual song in the back. Because I think it's so much more fun. Because if it's just like the karaoke version, I get really self-conscious about the way I sound. Even when I'm drunk too. Like it, I still am like very self-aware. And I think like having the actual song is different because it, it starts to feel like you're singing along in your car. And I really like that experience. Okay, so we have some condensed milk here that I have to put away. So I'm gonna get some plastic wrap. Dance like this, make one, make it speak Spanish. Como se llama, bonita, Shakira, Shakira. You make a woman go mad. I need backup? Yeah, carpool karaoke is the best karaoke, honestly. I need that extra extra boost of confidence. Cause the biggest I think the hardest part is like finding finding the note. And when they're singing with you, the note's right there. Honestly, these Oreos, I didn't like them that much at first, but I think they're growing on me. Like they're honestly growing on me. And my hips don't lie, I'm starting to feel it, boy. Oh my god, wait, this song? This song makes me so sad. Being drunk at night while singing to songs and eating Oreos. It is a good time. Monkey, I would recommend it. You should do the same thing. Alright, I gotta pull up the lyrics for this one, though. You guys know this song? It's, it's pretty old. LB living the life. It's just a normal Thursday. 
All right, here we go. It is really sad. I might start crying. I'm still alive when I'm barely breathing. Just pray to a God that I don't believe in. Cause I got time while she got freedom. Cause when a heart breaks, no, it don't break even. Her best days will be some of my worst. She finally met a man that's gonna put her first. Well, I'm wide awake, she's no trouble sleeping. Cause when a heart breaks, no, it don't break even, even. No, what am I supposed to do when the best part of me was always you? And what am I supposed to say when I'm all choked up that you're okay? I'm falling to pieces. I'm falling to pieces. Oreo O's are underrated cereal. Wait, there's an Oreo cereal? I do like Cookie Crisp, and Reese's Puffs are my favorite cereal. I'm slaying the sing-along, let's go! Still driven. And when a heart breaks, no, it don't break even, even, no. What am I supposed to do when the best part of me was always you? And what am I supposed to say when I'm all choked up that you're okay? I'm falling to pieces. I'm falling to pieces. I'm falling to pieces. I'm falling to pieces. I can't sing that high. Oh my god. Or you what? Cookie cereal? Cookie cereal is really good. Frosty mini wheats and cinnamon toast crunch. Cinnamon toast crunch, crunch is good. I'm not a huge fan of frosted mini wheats though. Imagine doing all this with the homies. I wish I could, but all my friends don't live here. <laughs> all my all my best friends don't live here. I have friends here. They're just not like my bestest friends. Cocoa Pebbles are pretty good too, I would agree. I think my favorite cereals. Loki, don't hate me for this. I really like Raisin Bran. I like Cookie Crisp, I like Reese's Puffs. And uh, what else do I like? I like Life Cereal. Life Cereal is good too. Cookie Crisp ate all that? I like it a lot. I like cookies. Do you like Honey Bunch of Oats? Honey Bunch of Oats is good. I do like a good crunch in my cereal. I'm falling to pieces. Honey Nut Cheerios aren't bad either. What are some other cereals out there? I like um, Captain Crunch. Captain Crunch is pretty good too. I don't like Lucky Charms. I don't like Lucky Charms and I don't like Frosted Flakes. Nothing wrong with Raisin Bran, but Life Cereal is crazy. Life Cereal is so good. It's literally just sugar. Set back from cereal as I had so much other food. That's fair. Lucky Charms are so below mid, it's only good because of the marshmallows. Yeah, Lucky Charms are... Lucky Charms gets a big thumbs down from me. Lucky Charms are not it. Lucky Charms are so bad. I don't know what's next. Oh, I don't know the lyrics of the song. Let's see. Huh. Oh, this song is good too. Uh. Ooh. Uh. Mmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mmm. Uh. Mmm. Uh. Mmm. There's a lot of mmm. Baby, I just don't get it. Do you enjoy being hurt? I know you smell the perfume, the makeup on his shirt. You don't believe his stories. You know that they're all lies. Bad as you are, you stick around 
and I just don't know why. If I was your man, baby, you'd never worry about what I do. I'd be coming home back to you every night, doing you right. Deserve good things, handful of ring. I just wanna show you you are. You should let me love you. You let me be the one to give you everything you want and need. Baby, good love and protection. Make me your selection. Show you the way love's supposed to be. Wait, I need Oreos. <laughs> God, I might be hungry. Should I just eat real food? I think I just might be hungry. Uh, uh. Mary True Beauty's description. Looks so good that it hurts. Plus 99. <laughs> Oreo, Oreo dance break. I think it's, it's one in the morning. I don't know if you guys know, but I gotta wake up at seven o'clock to get up for work. <laughs> Never worry about what I do. I'm gonna be honest, this is not what I was expecting, or this was not how I was expecting to spend my Thursday night today. <laughs> Are they normal Oreos or they, they look kind of weird? They're, they are different. They are, I don't know if I can show this to you. They're peanut butter Oreos. They're okay. I think, I don't think they're as good as normal Oreos. And they're definitely, my favorite Oreos are the mint ones. So next time I'll just get mint. Sleep soon? I should probably sleep soon. Thursday night, W Thursday night? Yeah, no, I'm having fun but I don't know if I would do this again. I have to think about it. Cause like, the thing is, um, you guys are here for this, but I'm gonna have to take this video down because of the music that I'm, I'm playing. But the thing is the music makes the experience. You want any baby good love and protection make me your selection show you the way love's supposed to be baby you should let me love you let me be the one to give you everything you want and need baby good love and protection make me your selection Love supposed to be Love you Let me be the one to Waking up at 7 sounds brutal. Yeah, it it sucks, but that those are my hours I'm fortunate though that on Friday I get out early. I get out around noon So I don't work the full day tomorrow So if I really wanted to I could go home after work and take a nap But one I want to stream tomorrow and two I gotta I want to get that motorcycle tomorrow, but we'll see it depends on how bad of a deal the dealership tries to get me. They might try to scam me, who knows. I don't know what song is next. I might hang around for like a couple more songs and then I think we will have to wrap it up. Don't sleep too late. I I'll try not to. Uh, uh, uh. I don't know the lyrics to this one. All right, these will be our last couple songs. I don't know the lyrics, hold on. I know I know the bridge, but that's about it. I do the same thing I told you that I never would, told you that changed, even when I knew I never could. I know that I can't find somebody else as good as you. I need you to stay, need you to stay, hey. Wasted, always oh, true. Realize the time that I wasted here I'll be fucked up if you can't be right here 2021 was nostalgia. I think this was the best song of 2021 for sure I'll be fucked up if you can't be right here I do the same thing I told you that I never would Told you I'd change even though something something <laughs> yeah, find nobody else as good as you. I need you to stay. I need you to stay. Hey. Wait, why is this song so fast? 
know that I can't find nobody else as good as you. I need you to stay, need you to stay. Uh, uh, you're the reason I believe in love. For me to trust. And I'm afraid that I'ma fuck it up. Ain't no way that I can leave you stranded. Empty handed. And you know that I know that I can't live without you. So baby, stay. Oh, 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 I'll be fucked up if you can't be right here. I do the same thing I told you that I never would. Even though I never did something, so oh, oh my god, I'm am I drunk? <laughs> Need you to stay. Hey, <laughs> nobody else is good as you. I'm having a great time. I don't know if you guys can tell. I'm having a great time. <laughs> the song is so fast. That's also shorter than I thought. The song is only two minutes long. Oh my god. Come with me. There's a world out there that we should see. Take my hand. Close your eyes. With you right here, I'm a rocketeer. Let's fly. Up, up, here we go! Up, up, here we go! The Disney music video for the song? Wait, was there actually a Disney music video? <laughs> up, up, here we go! Will we stop? Nobody knows! Will we stop? Nobody knows. To the stars if you really want it. Got, got a jet pack with your name on it. To the clouds in the atmosphere. Say the word and we out of here. Hold my hand if you're feeling scared. We fly up, up, out of here. Come with me. There's a world out there that we should see. Take my hand. Close your eyes. With you right here, I'm a rocketeer. Let's fly. Imagine just scrolling through shorts and seeing knockoff LB <laughs> singing, <laughs> sounding drunk. I forget that this shows up in the shorts feed. The face tracking LB is not LB. It is not. It's just a generic model. I have to get one commissioned first. Steamboat Willie type thingy? Wait, really? I had no idea. Yeah. <laughs> this is the dollar store LB. Cardio, till then let's fly, Geronimo. Come with me, there's a world out there that we should see. Take my hand, close your eyes, with you right- Oh my god, wait, I forgot. There's a Niga Higa cover version of this. I think it's, it's nice guys. Nice guys finish last. Oh my god, I forgot about that. <laughs> Watch me grab it. Wait, glow like oh, 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 oh. Wait, no, wait. No, it, it's not a cover of this. I think it's just their own song. I don't know why I thought this was the same thing. Nice guys finish last is also a banger song. I don't think it aged very well though. Niga Higa's verse was really bad. You know nice guys? Oh, you know it word for word? Really? I'll do it. I'll do it right now. Oh my god, this is gonna be such a throwback. How old is this? 12 years old! Oh, it's when Kev Jumba still was on YouTube. That's crazy. While I'll treat you like trash, it's not what I really want to do. Oh, you only date bad guys, so I'll give it my best try to 
Treat you the way you want me to. I never open the door. <laughs> the music video is so funny. Ever get cold? You'll just have to hack it, cause I'll be cold too if I gave you my jacket. Like, whoa! You ain't sitting up front. Front is for the homies. You can sit in the truck. <laughs> this song is so good. Nice guys finish last. That's while well, I'll treat you like trash. It's not what I really want to do. But you only date bad guys, so. I'll give you my best try to treat you the way you want me to. And I'ma beat you in every competition going out with the girls. You better get my permission. Wait, no, I take that back. You can't go. House is on tonight and that is my favorite show. Hell yeah, you do. <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> Nice guys, finish last, that's while I treat you like trash, it's not what I really want to do, oh, ooh. You only date bad guys, so I'll give it my best try to treat you the way you want me to. But behind the scenes, you mean the world to me. I'm gonna tell her that she's beautiful. And show her that she's loved And she's scared Tell her how much I care But that won't win her heart Because Nice guys finish last That's why I'll treat you like trash It's not what I really want to do You only date bad guys So I'll give it my best try to Treat you the way you want me to. <laughs> I forgot they say ho at the end. Oh my god. This song is so good. That's crazy. Old Niga Higa was peak for sure. What a throwback. The ho brings it together for real. It really does. Oh my god. All right. I think, is that where we should end it? <laughs> That's a good one to end on, I think. But yeah, we'll wrap it up here. Anyways, um, yeah, thanks for showing up today. I appreciate it. Thanks for hanging out. It was a lot of fun. Thanks for spending time. Yeah, I don't know how to, can I even raid? I don't even know. I feel weird raiding on like a, a random vertical stream. We'll try it. Is anybody streaming? <laughs> Rico streaming. All right, we'll raid Rico. All right. Um, like I said, there's a decent chance I might not be able to stream tomorrow, but I will try my best. Thanks for hanging out today. It's been a lot of fun. Thanks for helping me find a uh, a good boba recipe, a boba cocktail recipe. But with that, W stream, I wasn't here half the time, but yeah. Well, thank you. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to finish this Oreo and then uh, we'll raid Rico. Mm. 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 The rest will have a good ship. Thank you. I appreciate it. I got to pull up Rico stream so that I'm ready to participate. Um, if you guys want to join the raid, I hope I have the bot on. Oh my god, wait, I don't have the bot on. Hold on. I don't know what my raid message is. I gotta type it. Chotto mate. No whips of chains on me. I don't know the lyrics. Uh, uh. There we go. Raid message? Yeah, where's my raid message? Oh, there it is. All right, we got it. Yeah, we're raiding into Rico. So if you'd like, feel free to swing over, say hi. Uh, I'll be there for a little bit before I go to bed. But with that, 
I'm gonna call it a night. Thanks for hanging out today. Have a good night, everybody. And I'll see you soon-ish, maybe? Bye. Right, where's my end screen? My end screen is over here. I have to find it. I don't know how to... How do vertical streams work? Ending. Ending. All right, bye. <laughs>